the MAC-10, another weapon that is returning from the first game. And actually, unlike the first game, I am not using this on the Firebug class because in the second game, there is shared perk weapon. So, you know, the Medic SMG can be used on both the Medic and the SWAT, and it'll get perks with both. So, I decided why not try this SMG on the SWAT because, well, it is an SMG, so the SWAT will benefit from using it. And it'll be a little interesting to use the Fire SMG on something that is not the Firebug. I mean, it does exactly what you would expect on the Firebug, you know? Shoots fire, a lot of bullets, pretty bullet hosey, just like the first game, so... Puts out a lot of damage pretty fast. So let's see how it is on the SWAT. This also gives me a good excuse to use the SWAT a little bit more because, well... I usually don't play with SWAT. I, I end up playing Berserker or Firebug or something that doesn't really need aim. <laughs> Pretty important on the SWAT, though. Gotta get a lot of headshots. And I don't know if this fire damage that the MAC-10 is doing is gonna be a substantial damage increase, or if it'll even help me at much at all. But, eh, that's what this is... That's what we're doing this for, right? To see how effective this weapon is. And I'm just getting bitten by crawlers everywhere. Good god. Oh, hey, there's a SWAT. Or, not a SWAT. A Scrake. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Not as effective as I thought it would be. Oh my good god. <laughs> He's not dying, actually. Thank you. So, it's not like the Chris where I can just stand in front of an enemy and just unload on his face. That much is certain. Takes a little bit more. It's still a good headshot popper. At least from using it a little bit right here, so... It has its uses. I should probably stop being dumb and, uh, you know, go and help the team defend the spot that they're defending. Let me just make the use out of the set time here because, lo and behold, level 25, hey! Limited ammo. Yeah, just let him dance the fire. <laughs> okay, so with the team shooting, it's not too bad, but trying to do it on my own. Especially with this tier of weapon, because, uh, it's one of those 1100 weapons. It's, I guess it's not going to be super great. The only thing that kind of sucks about the MAC-10 in conjunction with the other SWAT weapons is that it has iron sights, whereas most of the other SWAT weapons have really nice red dots and they're super easy to use. MAC-10, you got iron sights. Not the worst, but I mean, it's kind of hard to see out of if you're really, uh... If, you, you, if you're used to ADSing a lot. For me, I like hip firing a lot, so it's not a huge issue, but hey. And very nice. I got the headshot on that albino, so... Couldn't spray gas everywhere. So! Uh... <laughs> oh, the fire's helping out! The fire's helping out! Oh, not bad! Not bad! Okay. So the fire does come in handy. I was thinking maybe because I'm not on firebug it wouldn't have the same effects, but I guess uh, status effects do still affect the Zeds to some extent. More Zed time, please. Yeah, more Zed time. Okay, okay, JK. Maybe we shouldn't go back into that room because everything hurts. Not see that guy. Or girl, sorry. Even though when I say guy, it's a very general term. We must have a level 6 commando somewhere. 6? Six? 6? Six? Uh, 25. Okay. Okay, okay, crawlers. Okay, I hate crawlers. Really doesn't matter what class I'm playing. Usually they're a big annoyance as a berserker. Nah, 
just as annoying on any other flasher plane. That is definitely no bueno. Alright, good! The fire! Get him! Get him! Holy shit, okay. This is actually coming in pretty handy. Not gonna lie. Crap, I messed that up. I messed that up. I've been playing a lot of, uh... Vermintide, unfortunately, and I... I get a little too used to trying to ping specials. The ping button in that game is my grenade button here, so I threw two grenades when I didn't really mean need to. Uh, I feel real bad because I let a teammate down. That's the worst thing. Okay, there's two of them. I should uh, back up. Did I kill them both? <laughs> I guess that kind of shows you the difference between this weapon and the next tier weapon, which was the, uh, the Chris Super V, whatever it's called in this game. Decent for the head popping, decent for the CC, but other than that, it's not going to have quite the impact that the other weapons are going to have for SWAT, which makes sense from a balance standpoint, because it does have fire. Seems to be fairly effective against Husk, too. It doesn't seem to have any downsides, despite being a fire-based weapon. Let's fuck up his legs. Just going a little crazy there. Okay, let's see. Yeah, definitely not nearly as effective. So it's a good trash clearing weapon, but otherwise... Leave it to the other weapons for the strikes. Wow, that was cool. Wow, I just saw a bunch of flesh pounds right there. Uh, I should probably get out of here. Yeah, let's get out of here. In the spirit of the MAC-10 as well as, well, most firebug weapons in general. They're good for trash clearing, they're not really good for big enemies. I've come to really, really notice that, especially after, well, this is wave 10 now. It's not gonna be super good at killing bosses or big dudes outside of the, you know, little special effect you can get on them just by setting them on fire and they'll do a little dance. Uh, they're not, s they're not super useful. They're alright. Which is to be expected. That guy's dying. We should help, we should help. Oh shit, that's a lot of, that's a lot of uh, scrakes. God, I will say that this weapon is great for hip firing because the fire rounds, they're like tracer bullets. You can just see so much of it. Very easy to follow. Very easy to hip fire. Uh, hi. Medic, heal yourself. I think it might be good just to try to clear. Try and clear everything else for now. Oh shit. Uh. Anyway, there's going to be a lot of flesh pounds. 
Let's make them all dance, shall we? Except for maybe the king one. The king one won't dance. Thank you. That medic is doing some crazy nonsense there. He's being chased by him. Yeah, he's not taking damage. He's doing some shotgun blast shenanigans or something. Does appear to be going after our sharpshooter. We should help him. Oh boy. JK! I thought he died for some reason. No, that was just some guy leaving the game. Ah! Yeah, you can really feel this weapon uh, not work too well when this boss is around. All the flesh pounds and this boss in particular. But I'll light him up so that everybody knows where to shoot. Got totally carried. But, hey, I'll pretend like I did something. 